Hello students, so let's try to solve one very interesting problem from just 2024. This problem is from mechanics and this is from the uh, central force problem, mainly Kepler's law. So what is this? In this problem, a satellite is moving in an elliptical orbit with semi-major axis A and assume that total energy of orbiting satellite is E. So E is given and we can easily find the value of E in term of A also from the Kepler's first law. And it is given that angular momentum is L and it is given that series of maneuvering of this satellite it will finally reach at the new orbit that is in circular nature but its radius is also remain same A. So what should be the true for the uh, what should be the true option uh, or correct option. So what is the first one energy does not change but angular momentum will change energy change but angular momentum does not change both angular momentum and energy will change neither E or nor L will change. So students we are talking about central force problem so in one particular orbit in a given orbit such as if it is into this particular elliptical orbit then its angular momentum and energy will remain same. If we want to change the satellite from elliptical orbit to circular orbit. So if we want to change from elliptical orbit to circular orbit, suppose my, this is my satellite and I want to change here to here. So this is your satellite and we are just want to change here to here. Then in a very crude way, we have to change both energy and both angular momentum. But in a smart maneuvering of satellite, we have to take care of conservation law. So in general, if effective potential is not going to change, then what will happen? Energy have to change and we have to keep our angular momentum conserved. So this is a very general way to maneuver the satellite, but this is a different case. Let us try to analyze this case. What will energy when it is into the elliptical orbit? So into the elliptical orbit, this energy is E, which is given and that value is minus K upon 2A. You can easily prove from your Kepler's first law and we can find that value is E is equal to minus K upon 2A. Now let us try to calculate what will be energy into the new uh, circular orbit. So for the new circular orbit, we have centripetal force and I am writing the centripetal force in term of angular momentum. That value is equal to external force and external force is equal to K upon R k upon r square. So what we will get? We will get L square is equal to m k r where r is the radius and this radius is exactly A but we will put it into the last. And what will be energy? The my energy is exactly equal to my effective potential and that value is equal to this one. And when we, I will put the value of L square is equal to m k r then this value is m k r upon 2 m r minus k by r that value is minus k upon 2r and in this particular problem r is given minus k upon 2a this is this is given parameter so here what you will find you will find that energy of a satellite into new orbit is also same what will be the energy into the elliptical orbit so here it has also minus k upon 2a here also minus k upon 2a and if energy is remain same energy is going to be same then there is only one option that we have to change my angular momentum and then only satellite can move into the new orbit so what will be answer the answer is that energy is not going to change but angular momentum will change so what is going to happening actually so actually the all changes are in the mathematically into the effective potential. So what is going to happen here? So let us try to see if we are, we are just going to talk about effective potential, effective potential is L square upon 2m r square minus k upon r and this is my effective potential. So this effective potential is V effective versus r and this is the condition for the elliptical orbit. So this is condition of elliptical orbit and this is the value of energy and this energy is nothing but minus k upon 2a. So it is given. Now if we will change the 
value of L, then what will happen? This L will change such that we have a new shape of effective potential and that shape will be something like that because potential in the shape of potential energy is not going to change and this will be the condition for elliptical uh, sorry this will be condition for circular orbit for the same value of energy so energy is remain same energy is going to remain same but yes we have changed our angular momentum and such that we can get a new orbit so students this is a wonderful problem you have to solve this problem with yourself think about this problem this problem is really conceptual and this is all about the satellite maneuvering thank you